Well, good afternoon guys and welcome to a Sunday afternoon. Uh, I'm not in Patea. I'm going to sound like a Geordie here, but I'm in Huayai. Yeah, H-U-A-Y, Y-A-I, Huayai. Anyway, uh, normally on a Sunday it's Nong's day off, so we try and come out and uh, do something a bit different. So today, I'm going to pull you over here, you can have a look. We're at Banna Garden. Uh, it's like a bar restaurant over at, over in Huayai. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, he does some lovely food here. So let's take, go inside, let's take a little look and see what's on the menu. Uh, I will try and do your map, okay? We'll see how that works out. Uh, so as you can see, if you're looking at the map now, uh, we come out of Patea and head towards Bang Sere a little bit. Then we turn left onto Huayai Road and we come a fair way along it past the big temple and there on the right hand side is Ban Na Garden Resort. Um, if we took a left opposite it would take us over to Chak Nok uh, Lake and there's a couple of temples over there as well. So there are some nice things for you to see out in this area. Okay, so uh, yeah, here's the entrance. As you can see, it's kind of lovely garden setting here. We've got Friday with us today. There's Nong Nui. I can't even see where the camera's pointing with the sun. In my... It's actually a friend of mine that owns this restaurant, but um, I haven't seen him for a fair while. Normally when I come out here, uh, I'm on my bike and it's very early in the morning so he's not he's not awake and up and about when I go past normally. So I'll let you have a little look around the place. Yeah, so there's about 11, 11 tables uh, ranging from tables for two, majority of tables for four. and. Uh, even a table for eight, I'm sure they can accommodate whatever your whatever your needs were. Okay, we uh, Sunday lunch here doesn't well Sunday roast lunch doesn't start till twelve thirty. Uh, it's, it's about ten past twelve. So this big green thing chasing me. Uh, you see, <laughs> big green one. So uh, yeah, we're we're out here a little bit early. So. We'll have a look at the menu and um, we'll probably just choose from menu rather than Sunday roast. Uh, the good thing is we're having a, an English owner. Everything's written properly, you know, it's uh, the spelling's correct and so you can see it, there's a classic starters, soups and treats. Uh, if you're into your oysters, and I am not, but he does a, a good selection of oysters. I think his wife's family has an oyster farm somewhere. Uh, over on the left side here, all day salads. Uh, sorry, salads. And over here, all day breakfasts. Okay. And uh, sandwiches. Big range of burgers and the likes. Pastas. Uh, this page here is around the world easy eats fish and chips, bangers and mash, beef stroganoff, mussel marinara, chili con carne, and then we're into classic main dishes. <clears throat> so you can see, predominantly now it's been uh, European uh, traditional Sunday roasts, uh, the, max, the biggest one, the mega mix, 485. It's it's basically a mix of all the roasts and it's a very large portion. Uh, and the rest of them he does small and regular portions of lamb, beef, chicken and pork. On a Wednesday night they do a curry, a curry menu. Let me have a little look there. And this is what we're having today from the Thai, Thai food menu. So uh, I quite like it when uh, when I come out with Nong, because she just she knows what I like, so she just picks me the things that she likes and that I'll eat so that she's got plenty to choose from on the table. 
noodles and rice, and this page is traditional Thai curries. So uh, she's had a good look at the menu already, and um, it's potluck for me, so we'll see what I get today. Hello. Hey. So we've brought our uh, our little boy with us today. He's just had a shower. Hey, you, you got doobies? No. He's, uh, there's too much for him to see here. He's, he's trying to take it all in, all the garden and everything. Handsome boy. Happy boy! <laughs> yeah, good boy. Yeah, so this is what Sundays are all about. Out with the missus, the wee dog, bottle of beer, and some nice, nice lunch. You know, it's uh, it's easy to have a nice time out in uh, Pattaya. Um, pretty much the whole of Thailand. That I wouldn't have thought other places are that much different. Uh, just Pattaya gets a bit of a bad rep because of the, you know, the centre of Pattaya activities. But you don't have to go far to have a uh, high quality life, uh, reasonable costs and. This is one of the enjoyments of a Sunday. I mean, if I compare it to back in the UK just now, there's probably a bit of snow, lots of wind, and it'll be uh, dark till 10 in the morning and dark at 3 in the afternoon. So, yeah, here it's pretty much the same every day. It gets light at 6.30 and it gets dark at 6.30. And that's, it changes a little bit, but not much. It's very, very little changes. And uh, even when it rains, the rain's warm. So you can kind of live with it. Okay, looks like our food's just arriving. So that one there is a chicken panang. Yeah, you can see there's a, f a few more uh, people arrived. Uh, there's probably a table of two, another guy, and then another four at the back. So, yeah, it's just gone 12.30 and it's uh, picking up. All right. Tasty? Not spicy. Eh? Not spicy. Not spicy. Yeah, and Nui knows I'm, I'm not very good with spicy, so she always makes sure that it's, it's to my kind of spice level. And as I've said in previous videos, that Thai food generally comes in bite-sized chunks, so it's it's highly unusual for you to get a. I'll put this around a little bit. It's unusual to get a knife and fork. You know, this is this is what you need: spoon, pasta Thai, chorn. Chorn. Okay, so you need a spoon, chorn. So yeah, knew he tried it and said it's not spicy. <clears throat> I need to tell you, her not spicy and mine not spicy are slightly apart. For me, it's uh, yeah, I can eat it no problem, but it's a little bit spicy. Mm. And what's that one now? Prawn and yellow curry. Okay, that's prawn, prawn and yellow curry. It looks a bit different from what I normally like on this, you know? And crab. And that's a pork neck with a, what kind of sauce, honey? Tamarind? Spicy. Oh, a spicy sauce. Okay. And there we go. Nam Jim Jiao. 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 Nam
uh, maybe see somewhere new that you might fancy giving a try yourself. Enjoy. It's not P this one, eh? Uh, Eggplant family. Okay. Bitter, yeah? Mm. I don't know if you can see this, uh, this one here. It looks like a big pea, but it's not. It's from the eggplant family. If you have a green curry, you get these, but they're bigger. And they cut them into quarters. But um, sometimes you'll find these in your, in your meal. Uh, they are quite bitter. And I don't like them. <laughs> I love. But Jack Sprat could eat no fat, uh, eat no fat, and it's very much the case here. Whatever I don't like, Nui always loves it. This, uh, all this kind of stuff at the back, the healthy stuff. Nui's in her element as long as it's nice and fresh, and it looks lovely and fresh here. She likes it. Yeah, we were. Uh, <clears throat> we decided to order another, another rice. <clears throat> Remember we went to Paboon the other week <clears throat> and we ordered a big rice rather than little ones. But this is sometimes the case, you know, the rice doesn't doesn't see you through the meal, so you have to get some extra. So I, I don't film us eating our whole meal. And some of the bits you miss actually are quite important. Um, New Evil, as she's doing now, She'll, she'll serve me the food that she knows, sorry darling, that she knows that I like and put it on my plate. Um, if you're back in the UK and you're watching this, I don't force Nui to do this. This is her taking care, okay? And it's reciprocal. I take care of Nui. So, uh, I think one of the reasons I left the UK is this political correctness has, has gone wild. Uh, I know that they say like men and women are equal and they're not. Men and women are, they're just different. You know, we're, we're different sexes. We're, we're built for different reasons. So, uh, I'm sorry, I'm one of these people that still opens the door for a lady. Uh, it's always ladies first. Uh, try and be polite and courteous to them at all times. And uh, she's extra loving uh, back towards me. And that, it hasn't arrived here yet and I hope it doesn't arrive for a long time because I don't think it helps society uh, this is not a Sunday lunchtime conversation is it but you can see where I'm going with it it's uh, women are special and they should be treated special uh, so all the mums and women in the world love you lots well we're, we're almost finished not the food, but us. We're almost finished. Uh, Nui's like, in my, you know. Yeah, the food's nearly, yeah, nearly finished. Yeah. But very tasty, eh? But uh, the prawn with the yellow curry not taste the same. You say, it, the taste was good, it just not looked the same. It's norm. Okay, prawn and yellow curry, it's. You're not going to like how I describe it, but it's like a scrambled egg, curry flavour with prawn inside it. This one maybe had maybe half an egg in it, you know. Normally there's there's a lot more consistency to it. Um, but taste-wise, it was still very good. It just, it wasn't what we were expecting, that was all. Uh, the Penang, very good, eh? Really, really, really good Penang. Um, I ordered not spicy, and it, for me it's got a little bit of tang, so it, it, Okay, scales are 1 to 10. Knew he can handle an 8. I can handle a 2. Okay, and that was a 2. Okay, so don't, don't think, oh my god, it's got to be so spicy I can't eat it. But remember, if you're not into spicy, tell them, my pet, and uh, they'll make it to your taste. Uh, if you like it Thai style, just, just order it, and they will, they will serve it normal style. Okay, most of it's in uh, in Thai. Uh, well, that's a, the top one's the Penang guy, and then uh, the pork neck, and then the prawn, prawn and yellow curry, uh, steamed rice, 
uh, to Leo and Coclite. Okay, so a total of uh, 910 baht. I'll convert that on the screen for you at current rates. Okay. So he's a happy boy, he got out for the day, he, he loves getting out and about, he loves his walks and looking around, I knew he just loves food. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me uh, put you out of the way and uh, spin you around. So that was us out at YI, uh, God, when you come out the sun it's bright, oh, stepping on my wee dog, uh, yeah, great lunch in there. So if you're out in this area and you're having a look at some of the temples and stuff like that, uh, nice place for you to stop, even if it's just for a cold beer or uh, you want some lunch. Okay, thanks very much for joining us once again in the channel. And for myself and Cheeky behind me here, we'll see you next time, okay? When we're living in Vitea. Bye bye for now.